Hello everyone and thank you so much for watching my video. I'm gonna make you a video about my top 10 favorite nude lipsticks. So yeah, let's just get into it. So uh, my favorite, my first favorite nude lipstick is the shade Cool Brown by Bourgeois Rouge Velvet Edition. It's a liquid matte lipstick, so it dries down and it's uh, transfer proof. It has a very good uh, lasting power and uh, the color is uh, this one. It's not really a cool brown, like the shade is not cool. Here it is on my hairy arm. <laughs> I'm sorry about that, but whatever, you know. So Cool Brown by Bourgeois. Okay, second, it's my uh, NYX Liquid uh, Suede uh, Liquid Lipstick. This one also is the same f kind of formula. It dries down matte and is transfer proof. This one is a bit darker, but I just love it so much. And it also has a little bit of a mauve shade. Did I tell you the color? It's the NYX Liquid Suede in the color 04. Oh, Soft Spoken Du Murmure. This is the color. And I love it so much. Then I have an Anastasia Beverly Hills one in um, Pure Hollywood. And it's a liquid lipstick. It's the same kind of formula, it dries down matte. Liquid when applied, dry it down matte. So here is the color. It's more of a light pinky nude. Very nice color, very good lasting power, but it's sometimes a little bit crackles. That's the only thing that's so so. Then I have the Okay, so this is uh, the Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color in the color Seduction. This is uh, a gloss, uh, no, a liquid lipstick, but that doesn't dry matte. Like, it's supposed to be matte, but it's not really matte, it's more like a cream, I would say. Oh my god, they all look the same, but... I guess I like the color. Just before reference, I am on NC35 right now, I think. And uh, so yeah, these are the colors that suit me right now. And obviously I'm showing you more of my like brownie nudes. I'm not going too much into the pinker, peachier, like just straight up nude right now. Oh, this is one that dries uh, down the matte as well. It's the Meat Matte uh, Hodges Long Lasting Liquid Lipstick and this one has a perfect formula, nothing to say and the color is committed uh, but the smell uh, <coughs> like smells like your grandmother's uh, mint uh, the, it's terrible it's really horrible, the smell. I absolutely hate it. Like old people's mint candies. Ugh. So here's the swatch. It's a very, very beautiful color. I absolutely love it. And it's supposed to be a dupe for uh, Lolita 2 from uh, Kat Von D. Interesting to know. Then I have one from MAC that is a matte formula that is called Kinda Sexy. I will put it here. This is the color. Very good lipsticks. It's just a little bit drying, but overall it's amazing. I just love it. Such a nice one. Oh, I have a lot of brands actually. Hmm, that's good. So, um, next I have the Matte Me from Sleek. Ultra Smooth Matte Lip Cream in the color Birthday Suit. This one is a very good one and it's like very affordable as well. Here it is. Don't they just look... Well, they're, they're all a bit different. They're, they're, I don't have duped. This one and this one look very similar though, right? But well. What can you do? I'm just a makeup collector, makeup addict. I just buy everything I like. 
as long as I can afford it. Um, then I have the Jara Cosmetics Supreme Lip Cream in Angel Cake. This is a liquid lipstick that has a shiny formula. And this one is very, very light. When you do like a dark smoky eye, this is a color that uh, you could use. Then I have one from uh, YSL. So uh, it's the number two, Rouge Volupté. The problem with these ones is that, is that you have to reapply them a lot. But it's like, it smells like nothing. The texture is just butter. Like it feels even amazing, but you have to reapply it all the time and it's super expensive. But it's still one of my favorites. It's more of a cool tone, this one, compared to the other ones. Still absolutely love it. Such a nice one. And then this one is one of my favorite of all time. I have it in my bag. This is already my second tube. And trust me, for me to use up a lipstick is like very, very hard. I have so many of them. Uh, it's the L'Oreal Gloss. It's supposed to be matte, but it's like kind of the same texture as uh, this one from Revlon. It's like... How to explain? It's matte-ish. It's not 100% matte. By the way, it's what I have on the li my lips with something added on top. I'll tell you after about it. So it's the color Amen. So do you see like... It's matte-ish, but it's not like the ones that dry totally, totally matte, if you know what I mean. Then I have an honorable mention for the uh, Kim Kardashian Wise by Kali Cosmetics kit. So I use these colors, I don't really use them individually, because they like create after a while a line here in the lip, and I don't really like that. But I use them to um, adjust colors, like if I think that my lip color is like too dark, I'll just use a lighter one. If I think it's too peach and I want it more pink, I add the pinker one. They're like, you have a darker nude, a light nude, a peachy nude and a pink nude. So basically you can just adjust uh, the color how you want it. So it's very very good for that I think. For adjusting your nude shades to make the perfect perfect flawless nude shade. So yeah, that's all of my uh, favorite top 10 nude lipsticks. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please if you have some suggestions leave them down below. Uh, I would love to make you happy. Okay, have a nice day. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.